it's your time to shine, Carlton. There are so many pets still out there in need of a home. This one is just looking for one here on our set, looking underneath the couch and everything. And joining me is Lisa Bernard with the Dane County Humane Society. This little guy here is Carlton. 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 Come on, Carlton. Tell us a little bit about Carlton. Where was he found? What's his backstory? So uh, a member of the public found him in Madison and brought him to us in May. Mm -hmm. And uh, he's he came very matted because oh. his hair is very long yeah. typically because uh, they think he's part La Salapsa. And um, he had to get shaved so it could be more comfortable for him to regrow. Here, buddy. And uh, so he's been looking for his family, just waiting for someone to come and say hello and say, hey, this is the pup for me. He's, he's an adult. Yes. Uh, very sweet, very friendly. He's been happily meeting people. Rode so well in the car on the way over here. Uh, haven't heard a peep out of him <laughs> the entire day. So he loves his treats. Fan of hot dogs. <laughs> and he's he's very curious, you know, very, yeah. very, very curious and calm, though a little bit too. What kind of mix do you think he is? Maybe a bit of a schnauzer, uh, potentially? It's hard to tell. It's our best guess, but based on size, they think La Salopsa might be one of them because okay. he was so hairy. Yeah. Uh, and it's hard to tell what the other could be, but his head is just so unique with his ears, and his ears are so... Like they respond so cute, like he's just like always perking and yeah. he'll like tilt his head. He's such an adorable <laughs> pup. He is such a good size too. You would think he was older than, uh, uh, younger than a year, but just a year old. Uh, any idea if he's good with other dogs or other cats potentially? Uh, so he is not a fan. He hasn't shown that he's a fan of other dogs. Okay. Because uh, he gets a little n unsure about them. So we're looking for a home without dogs. Okay. Uh, we don't know about cats, sure. how he would feel about them. Sure, but maybe not other dogs. But no. speaking of other dogs, you guys are working right now on your 2025 calendar, and you're hoping that the public can help you out in voting for the photos. Is that right? Yes, yeah, so it's the Madison, Madison Firefighters Local 311 that's putting the uh, calendar together. Uh -huh. They've been doing it every year since 2020. Yeah. And they're asking for the public to vote on their favorite uh, photos that will go in 2025's calendar. And to vote, you do have to donate. Okay, well, so hey. It's, it's got two prongs, you know, it's for a great cause and. Mm -hmm. This, this is the website fun. right here where you can find more information, giveshelter.org slash events. You only get 12 photos, so you want to make those votes count. Well, Carlton, thank you for joining us. If you'd like to adopt him, you can find more info on that website as well or through the Dane County Humane Society. Lisa, thanks for joining us. Thanks for having us. <laughs>